Hi guys, welcome to PSP tutorial series. In this video, we are, I will uh, show you how to create a form in PHP. And at the same time, I will explain you what is the difference between PHP get and post method and uh, what if uh, we use post and what if we use uh, get in our program. Okay. Let us go to our editor here. First, we need to create our form okay just create a body and then quickly create a form okay in form you need to mention by which way you want to send your data to your server okay you need to uh, give it a method okay i want to use get method that is i want to post my data with the help of get method uh, or then uh, you need to give it the name of your file okay action it will, I am posting to same file Good. PHP and then let us create a label label as username and text box type text sorry guys typing mistake name username just copy it copy paste it password change the name this name is important here guys because you need to refer your text box values uh, in PHP code with the help of this name field okay let us create a button just copy it and paste here Put type submit let us use a button of type submit and then give it a name of submit and give it a value as submit okay now if we or let us use a line break copy it paste and save let us go to our browser see we have created our form now let us write our php code come here to start with the if condition if if our form is set or if a user has entered the value data underscore get since I am getting I am posting my data uh, with the method of get so submit user equals to dollar underscore get then username just copy it paste type password here change your variable and echo here I will explain you guys once I complete and run this program entered your username and and password. 
password okay all right now we have written down our php code okay now let us see let us refresh okay there is an error unexpected dollar pass at line 26 okay come here 26 okay i just forgot to give it a dot operator let us run it password okay you have see you have successfully entered your username and password okay let us make it as type password okay see guys i have posted um, uh, my data with the help of get method using form see if i refresh just enter okay type password type input type password name password get submit okay just refresh it username password see now it's showing me the message you have successfully entered your username and password okay guys Uh, see let me explain this program so, uh, see guys you know I have used get method to post my data to the server here I have created a form and in form we have, I have created a username and password to two text fields and a submit method uh, sorry submit button to submit our data to the server in form you need to uh, give two uh, parameters like I would say uh, first, first is method uh, you need to tell your form by which method you want to send your data to server in this case I want to uh, send my data with the help of get method and you need to uh, use the file name okay index.php I am using a PHP uh, codes in this final file only that's why I have mentioned index.php okay with this this code I am sending my data to the server with the help of get method if is set dollar underscore get submit here it's checking whether you have uh, uh, properly entered your data whether your form is uh, set or not uh, whether you have entered your username or password in your text boxes here it's checking that this submit will be come from this button here it will check whether before submitting uh, whether the data uh, uh, you are inputting is uh, already is entered in the text box or not uh, whether if you are uh, sending an empty data or or you have entered a data here it will check and once you have checked that uh, you have entered the text box values then it will come here username and password it will assign those text boxes values into user and pass variables and then it will print those values uh, to your browser okay this is the explanation guys in my next video i will come and i will uh, use post i will uh, post the data with the help of post method and then i will explain the difference between get and post okay guys i hope you understand this uh, program or the use of form and the get method uh, okay if you like this video uh, subscribe to my channel thanks for watching guys